Hi Talk Pushers! Welcome to our inbound call feature demo. In this video, you will learn how to set up your account so recruiters can receive calls from the candidates in the Talk Push CRM itself. Here is how to set this up. Step 1. You will need to ask your CSM or account manager for the unique number which the candidates are supposed to dial in order to connect to the recruiters. This is the number of this account. You can share this number manually to the candidates, implement this in your message settings, or just simply save a quick reply. As you can see, for this video, I have set this up as a quick reply. For the next step, you will need to input a valid number in your account. Please note that this number is not what the candidate should dial. This merely triggers your availability so the candidates can connect to you when they dial the number previously shared in this video. Now that you've saved your phone number, the next step for you is to activate your availability by clicking on the inbound phone icon. Well done! Now that you are available, the candidates can now connect to you. But before we move on to the exciting part, I would like to explain the logic of how the calls connect to the recruiters. For example, this candidate is in Recruitment Assistant India campaign. When this candidate calls, he or she will connect directly to the first recruiter under the round robin assignment. Let me show you how to get to this setting. Click on the Campaign Settings and go to Permission Settings. Under Round Robin Assignment, if the first recruiter declines the call or does not answer, the call will automatically connect to the next recruiter in the list. In this setting, the call will automatically connect to Tanya. If Tanya declines or does not answer the call, the call will connect to Sudipta instead. Now, if there is no recruiter in the round robin list, the candidate will just have an option to leave a voicemail. Now let's move on to the actual demo. I will send this candidate the quick reply that I've set up earlier. You are calling Talk Push Staging. To prevent this call from being recorded, press 1. To allow, press any other keys. We are now trying to connect you to our representative. You can also check the logs under Call Activities. Here is how. When the list loads, you can see which calls have been completed, cancelled, and candidates that left a voicemail. In addition, you can conveniently click on the candidate's name to load another window. As you can see, there are call recordings which you can listen to as well. That's it for this tutorial. Thank you for watching.